The second way you can recognize and identify when a person is jealous of you is when you get a sense that they are trying to inject themselves into your life and then put their responsibilities on top of it. It's it's like they're trying to uh, 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 create a scenario where uh, they're in your shoes. They're, they're living your life, but with their responsibility. Okay, let me let me explain it. Let's say you're single with no kids and uh, just living your life. And this person has two to three kids and uh, no job. They'll look at you and tell you, what's wrong with you? Why you don't have kids yet? And why you're not married? And why you don't have this and why you don't have that? If it was me, I would be married with kids by now. And it's like, hold on, wait a minute now. Wait a minute. <laughs> hold on. You're not married, number one, and you're trying to tell me that I should be uh, number two. If I wanted to be uh, a baby mama, if I wanted to have kids, if I wanted to be married, I would be. So now you're trying to define me for me, and you can't even define yourself. So now you're you're telling me where I should be in my life with your responsibilities. That is not how life works, and uh, jealous people tend to uh, look at life that way. You know, they'll they'll inject themselves into your reality and then place their responsibilities into into your life and tell you what you should be doing and how you should be doing it. And yet they're not doing it for themselves. You know, jealous people have a warped reality, um, a, a distorted way of thinking. And then they impose that way of thinking onto you. <laughs> that's, you know, that's a, a good number two right there. Uh, a, a second way to recognize when someone is jealous of you because they'll try to uh, uh, define your identity. If that's not jealousy, I don't know what is.